Hey yo, my planet coaster friends, Johnny5 Alive here, and welcome back to another coaster spotlight contest edition. In today's episode, we have two dueling multi-looping coasters. So stay tuned and let's check them out. All right, welcome back everyone. Hope you're all having a wonderful day. We're gonna jump right on into things with Huma versus Panther created by Clever, one of our Discord builders. And here they say it has a jungle theme with two different types of coasters. <laughs> ride preferences say, please ride Puma at night in seat view and Panther at day in chase view. All right, so it sounds like we got a Puma versus Panther here today. Let's jump on into it, shall we? And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, a bit of a mini park. So let's go adventuring. Whoa, let's head on down. It's looking good. I like the, uh, Exterior leading up to the coasters. Very jungle vibes. Ooh, there's our cues. Whoa, why is my mouse doing this? Planet Gozer! Uh, wow. Yeah, some great views. What's this Mexalente doing? Oh, it's a statue. A plane. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I like it. Okay, we're gonna start with the uh, Panther, I guess. Head on down the queue. There's a lot of people in here. My goodness. Ah! Wow. Wow, wow, wow. How many people are in queue? Only 1,800. <laughs> okay, here we are. Let's look at the coaster. Inverted four seat arrival. There's a look at all the stats. They requested us to look at this at nighttime. Is there a lot of nighttime lighting? Indeed. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, I'll cut to it when it's ready. Okay, I feel like a lot of people have forgotten to put music on their coasters. Let's jump. I don't think we need to go down that queue. We already went on this one, but we're going to flip it back to daytime as requested by the creator. Here's a look at the stats for the Puma, and we're also dealing with a floorless werewolf for this guy. The stats are looking good. Really good. Okay, we're going to jump right on it. There we have it. Okay, let's talk about it. So I feel like the coasters were a little bit short, to be honest. Um, they had el dueling elements, definitely, and pretty good ones at that. I do, I do think so. I also think the coaster had pretty good stats. 
I think you played a little bit safe, to be honest, because they were so short. Between the be beginners and the builders so far, I think you controlled the stats of your coasters pretty nicely. I mean, the cues speak for themselves. <laughs> the guests are pouring on. And uh, yeah, so I think the coasters are solid. I think there are good dual-lead elements, but I do feel like it left a little bit to be desired. It was a little bit short. And uh, let's move over to the theming. I think the uh, aesthetics are great. You did, you did a nice entry to the park. You did a nice mini park area and uh, you did put some element into your theming you have some pumas and panthers about but that's a pretty tricky theme to go off of i would mu i would say in terms of the spirit of the contest and that is something we're probably going to bring up a lot that's a tricky theme to capture because what we have here is a generic jungle run and other than one being white one being black and and a couple basic shapes is there anything defining them is there really much of a difference between a puma and a panther i don't know well what are those distinctions and how could you represent that in a coaster it's tricky going with that theme. So there's nothing that like in terms of uh, theming and spirit, it's not really wowing me. And it's playing it a little bit on the safe side, I would say. However, it's artistically polished. The coasters were good. It had dueling elements. So I think I come out of this saying it's a solid submission. You put the effort in, you put the details in, and it you def definitely did not slouch on your effort. So from a builder, it's exactly what I would expect. It's a solid submission. There's good effort gone into it. You're showing your ability to do things at a builder or above level. So I come out of it saying, I think it's a good submission. I really do, but it is a big bracket. It's a competitive bracket, 25 submissions. How is it gonna fare in terms of spirit of the contest, dueling elements and all that? We're gonna have to wait and see, but at the end of the day, it's up to the viewers. So be sure to keep an eye on the uh, community tab. Uh, I mean, <laughs> you got about a week <laughs> before we start voting, but definitely, uh... oh, look at that. That's a cool, cool element, but definitely a strong effort here by Clever, one of our Discord builders on Puma versus Panther. What did you guys think? Leave your comments down in the comment section below. And that's gonna do it for me to, in today's video. We're gonna keep things moving along and I'll see you all in the next contest submission. Bye now.